Hey guys, Michelle here for Together We Are Mondays. So this week the topic was choosing my Anna Girl Empath and it is self-worth and what helps with like improving that. So I think that I voiced it in some of my videos recently, but I think that one thing that really helps me with recognizing my self-worth and kind of getting a better sense of self would be positive affirmations. Um, actually, um, Positive affirmations are just repeating positive phrases, things that you like about yourself, whether it be about your body, your personality, or just your life in general. Um, they're compliments that you give to yourself, and it's important that you you choose um, affirmations that really like will hit you, not just like something that'll have no meaning or no effect on you. And I know I have a full list of affirmations that I can read through every so often. Um, but one thing that I recently started doing was I felt like I would have my affirmations, but I wasn't con using that when I was looking in the mirror and I was feeling like my self-worth was going down in the mirror. But then in my room when I was reading the affirmations, I was like so glad about myself, you know? Um, so one thing I did was actually I made index cards um, as something that like just helps me because you can like either tape them to your mirror or... You can just have them on hand when you go into the bathroom. It makes it so easy. Um, and I wrote down things, and again, it's important that these affirmations are something that'll hit you. So a lot of the times, like, I I don't believe that I'm beautiful, okay? Um, so if I wrote, I am beautiful, that wouldn't really affect me. So instead, I wrote, I'm freaking gorgeous because that has a greater effect on me. Um, and it's doing things like that and just having like these cards and like, I don't know, let me find a good one. Oh, I like this one. Um, I am lean, sexy, and strong. Um, good things like these to have on hand. And they're perfect to bring like in your wallet, you know, um, so that you have them whenever you're at a party and you're feeling really down about yourself, just having these affirmations to help you recognize your worth because in the end our eating disorder wants to tell us that it's the scale it's how much you eat or how much you don't eat um that really makes you into who you are but it's quite it's quite weird it actually goes against all natural instincts like why we would starve ourselves or why we would binge and purge or over exercise or abuse laxatives it just I don't know, it takes up so much time and it goes against what our bodies are naturally meant to do. And it does get us in a cycle that tears us down and makes us think such belittling thoughts. Um, so I think that positive affirmations and using them in your daily life, like not just pretending to, but actually using them is key to um, raising your self-worth. I think that it's definitely important to do like the exercise even if you aren't feeling it specifically that day so there might be a morning where I wake up and I might not feel like I am let me see that I'm freaking gorgeous but having like me repeatedly say that that even on those mornings when I don't feel like it just like having that reiterated in my head that I am good enough basically um so i think that's what i would offer is the use of pos positive affirmations um and definitely like incorporating them into your life and having them on hand um i know one thing that Susie, who is together we are saturday has said um if you can't think of like positive things about yourself and you can't come up with any affirmations, feel free to ask your friends. Have them write down something that they like about you. Or um, you can even go online. There's a whole slew of, um, of positive affirmations that you can find and kind of pick and choose which ones really hit you, you know? So I would say go with that. Um, now, the question this week is, what are five positive attributes you possess? Or in other words, what are five good things about you? Um, so I took this question as like five qualities that I like about myself, um, or things that I like have. I, I love that I'm passionate. As you guys know, um, 
I am very passionate about psychology and I plan on majoring it in university and I'm just, I don't know, it's like, I'm actually writing a paper for fun right now. It's a research paper and it's about mental illness and eating disorders and their validity and it's so good, but it's good stuff though. Um, I would say the second thing would be that I'm cre creative. I love the fact that I'm creative. I actually never was into art before, like recently, and so um, it's it's really changed my world, like being involved in art. I mean, if you guys have seen my wall, it's art. <laughs> um, uh, the third thing would have to be, uh, I think I'm really sarcastic. Like, I don't know, I have a very quick wit. And I love being sarcastic, like, it's the best thing ever. So I would have to say my sarcasm is something that I love about myself. It's a positive attribute. Um, fourth would be that I am kind of, that I'm trustworthy, that people come to me and they're willing to open up and talk. Um, and a bunch of you guys have messaged with me and also my friends um, come. And it's really nice to, to have people know that they can come to me for support. Um, but yeah, I'm always here to listen, which is a wonderful attribute of a future psychologist, let me tell you that. But, um, yeah, definitely being that is, is good. <laughs> um, I would say the last positive attribute about myself, or something that I like about myself, um, would be, I didn't think of these ahead of hand, so I'm kind of behind on this, um, that I... We'll see. I think I would have to go with the fact that I love and I want to get better and I'm very hopeful and if hopeful means that every morning I look at myself in the mirror and say I'm freaking gorgeous, then that is what I am. Um, I think that I do get knocked down, I do get those times when everything feels like it's swelling in and I just want to retrogress into the eating disorder, but I think that my hope is really the thing that pulls me through and lets me wake up every morning and say, I'm freaking gorgeous. Um, so I think that's really it for this video, guys. Um, can't wait to see what the other girls have to say, and if you guys are watching this video, awesome. And just to let you know, if you've gotten to this point, write in the comments below that I am freaking gorgeous because um, all of you guys are gorgeous and totally worth it. Um, so I hope this video helps somebody and I will see you guys next week. Bye!